This is the day for old man upset. The fans at Grant Field in Atlanta see Georgia Tech get away to a fast start over Rice as Stan Can passes to Billy Williamson for 17 yards. Rice is the nationally ranked team, but they don't face Can. This pass to Billy Martin is good for 20 yards. That man can again to Chick Kining as Tech chalks up another 16 yards to the Rice 13. Granning follows that up with a slant around right end for eight yards to set up a touchdown. From the five, what a man can rolls out to his left, keeps the ball, and goes over for a Tech score. In the second quarter, who's in there pitching? Mr. Can, 15 yards to Granning. McNamee gives Can a rest and carries up the center. Paul Piper carries and slices off left tackle. Six yards to the three. Then McNamee pops through and over. Rice tries to rally, but Randall Kerbo throws right into trouble. Don Toner intercepts for Tech. The rambling wrecks are Rick and Rice. Doug Cooper takes the ball with a sweep around right end. A pickup of nine yards. Can takes charge again. He connects with Williamson for 17 yards. Can is boss man today. Can't find a receiver. So he's a do-it-yourselfer. Eight yards. Three plays later. Granning swings wide. Round right end. And goes over. Tech has favored Rice coming apart at the seam. Rice is stopped cold again in the third quarter is Tom Winninger. Intercepts Billy Cox's pass. Williamson lugs it up the middle for 10 yards as the period comes to an end. Moving the other way, Ken loses his arm again. Tosses to Williamson and more. Then Billy Lawfridge does like Stubby Ken. With just as much finesse, he hits Martin for 14. Stalled. Tech kicks a field goal from the 35, and Rice goes down to a stunning upset, 24 to nothing. 